Here's Alison. Now, just Alison, you're happy for us to put this onto our website and um, Facebook page? Yes. Functional Movement Training Centre, City of the Coast Neurosurgeon. Okay, so Alison's, Alison's had surgery a little while ago. And we're starting our, we're starting our post-op inpatient neurohab. Look at that perfect performance. It's really nice. Neurohab points of performance, hip-centric rotation, posterior chain activation, neutral spine awareness. And these are the very, very early <laughs> drills. As you can see, Alice is pretty happy with her pain management. Look at that. Very nice. Have a rest. Yeah, good, good, good. Yeah. I feel strong. I feel so good. You should. Here. It's a very strong yeah. position. So that. Like, what does that? What does that movement feel like compared to before? Like, Bill? It's it. It's unbelievable. To be honest. Yeah. Um, a few days ago, I was like, "This is." What, what did you say to me? What, I did. What were you thinking? What I was. Were you thinking? He did say on the first day, "You're going to walk out of here," and I honestly thought in my inside, "I'm like." A load of BS, mate. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, because you were in a lot of pain, weren't you? I was in so much pain. A lot of pain. And to the point, it worked, it has worked to the point which was proven to me. How many that, times have I seen you? Uh, four. In how many days? Two? Yeah, we started, yeah. we started late last week. We started late last yeah. week. Yeah. Um, surgery was on Monday. Surgery was on Monday. And Alan, just tell us what your pain was like uh, before the surgery. How long had you had back pain for? 12 months. 12 months of back pain. 12 months. Unrelenting, chronic, every day. Yep, every day. Uh, and I would have episodes of this whole leg uh, completely going out of uh, it. Uh, and then now I've noticed since the operation, um, say about the second day after the operation, I got sick of laying on the back. Uh, so I thought, right, you know what, I'm going to try and sleep on the side. Let's see how we can go. Uh, and I've, I've turned onto the side and I have slept uh, all night for the yeah, first 12 yeah. months. No pain. Amazing. And Alison, why did you have the operation? Um, I had um, SIJ um, issues and, and lots of yeah. um, lots of pain yeah. and things. And it would just. And we tried to get oh, that yeah. better without surgery, of course. We tried everything. Yep. We have tried everything. Yep. We had the cortisone shots. Yep. Um, I've lost count of how many therapists I've seen. Physical therapists? Yep, to try. What type get. of physical therapists? Um, I've had um, the physios, I've had um, the. I've been in the water. Exercise, before. physiology. Yeah, I've had. Um, hydrotherapy. Hydrotherapy, I've had. Lots of um, um, manual therapy, lots of rubs. Yeah, lots. Lots of rubs. 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 And that actually, honestly, brought me more pain. Stirred you up. Yeah. Um, and uh, so, what, um, what then, uh, after you had the injections, mm -hmm. the pain would sort of settle down for a very short period? The first one settled by about 10%. Mm. The second one did nothing. Mm. Nothing. Mm, um, mm, and then that is the only reason that I've decided, you know, it's been 12 months. Mm. Well, you've tried everything mm, for mm, me, mm. you've suggested everything. And then we tried the nails. Then you said, let's try a second needle. Let's just give it a shot before we throw you into surgery. Mm. Really exhaust everything. And so we did that. And then that didn't work. Um, and that, that was it. That made up my mind. Yeah. That it's got to be well, surgery. Clinically, Alison had a lot of positive SIJ provocation tests. She had a positive Faber. She had a positive Trendelenburg. Positive Gainsland. Positive compression. Um, a positive distraction, so that really gave us clinical uh, suspicion of sacroiliac joint dysfunction. She had some reasonable, very short-term response to SIJ desensitisation with CT-guided blocks, and so we were confident to then proceed to keyhole SIJ surgery. Can you, can we have a look at the little snippety 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 cuts? This is a PG rated, <laughs> so. That's very good. There's the, there's the little SIJ incision there. There's one incision there, one incision there. They're so close together that they just joined together to make one uh, incision for two bolts. And I'll show you some extra. That's just a tiny um, uh, little incision for the navigation frame. But there's our keyhole, keyhole. Okay, you pop your duds up. You know, That's you actually fantastic. did better than... Look, do you want to check the bruises while I'm here? 
than the needles of the nurse's yeah, opinion. Yeah, that That's would be line. more damage than what you have. <laughs> You've been uh, fantastic. <laughs> and then, as I said before, um, the functional movement therapy or our neurohab therapy is absolutely critical Mm -hmm. to getting your sacroiliac joint, your spine, your pelvis, your hips, all moving in a um, natural way Mm -hmm. that stops them from becoming inflamed and causing ongoing pain. Mm -hmm. So this is the second stage of the management of your chronic back pain, 12 months in the making. Mm -hmm. That, um, yeah. And, and none of your physical therapists taught you to move like this? No, no one and has taught you. actually still trying to teach me a different way now to mm. what I'm being taught. And yeah. then I'll go to a, a different stage. Mm. And, and they'll be like, no, don't do that or don't do yeah. this. And I'm like, yeah. no, I've been, this is what I've been told to do. Yeah. And they're like, oh. Yeah. So. Okay, and you're going back to graft and so... We need to follow your movement therapy training closely um, with uh, you sending us videos of your movement, making sure that your physical therapist out there, because there are no functional movement therapists in Grafton, no one from from our centre delivering yeah, neurohab. Grafton. But, Actually, but we're going to do a short course. Yeah, yeah, we're going to. You can probably teach them a thing or two. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All You're right. Up in the wards, aren't you? Yeah. <laughs> Fantastic, and we've got Mr. Bones here laughing away as well. <laughs> All right, fantastic. Alice, thanks for talking to us about Thank your story. You. That's really cool, and um, your story will help a lot of other people too. Beautiful. Great. Thank you. Thanks, Luke. Neurohab specialist. Thank you.